Hey guys, it's Angela and for today's video I am going to show you the before and after my uh, underneath my Christmas tree with all the presents. Um, I have quite a few presents to tuck under the tree and since the kids will not be home until Christmas morning, I can put them down under the tree early. Usually I wait until they go to sleep Christmas Eve. I never put presents under the tree before that. So it always looks a little barren. Here, let me show you what it looks like under the tree. Like that. So, um, yeah, I don't put any presents underneath ahead of time. But like I said, since the kiddos are at their dad's house, um, before, uh, until, I'm sorry, I can't talk to, I can't think, until Christmas morning, I can go ahead and put the presents under the tree. And I know that my daughter will probably be seeing this and she'll probably show Joey, but the presents are wrapped, so they're not gonna know what they're getting anyway, so. All right, guys, so here is the tree. There are the presents. So let's get these presents under that tree, shall we? All right, guys, ready? Okay, hold on one second. All right, so I got the camera situated and let's go ahead and get these presents under the tree, shall we? So usually what I do is I will start with the largest presents first. And I always try to put those towards the back and make sure that they have the names showing. Uh, let's see. Actually, let me put this one here for now. I'm trying not to move the tree skirt too much. Okay, and then we're gonna go with this one. Ugh. These are the big guys. Okay. Then we have this one. This one is a large box, but it is not heavy. Yay! Thank goodness for that. Let's take this one on this side. Okay. See, we got these two guys right here, and I love to mix up my colors, my wrapping paper colors, just because I don't like it all to look the same. I don't really bother with ribbons because nobody really appreciates it. They're just all about ripping into the boxes. So let's see. Let's put these in here. One here starting to come together a little bit. Okay, let's see. We're gonna put this guy on top of here. And this little silver guy right there. Oh, that's not it. There's more. Remember, I have three children. So let's see. Let's grab some of these red ones. Any more red under the tree? Okay. This red. Oops. There we go. More blue. I like to put the smaller ones up front just because it's easier that way. There's some more red ones and a couple of silver ones. Okay, so we're going to put silver ones down here. I'm going to stick a red one in here. And then it looks like we're going to have a little bit of red over here. So we're going to put this one right there. And this one, let's see. Let's do this. Let's cook this over. There we go. All right, guys. So that is it. That is how I like to arrange my trees. My, my trees. Oh, my goodness. My presents under the tree. Um, I think this year we're going to have a pretty good Christmas. What do you guys think? It, it'll look beautiful once the lights are on tonight. And it's nice and dark. And it's all Christmassy. But... 
Let's see, I'm trying to get a good angle. Yeah, that's it. So what do you guys think? I think that looks pretty good, huh? All right. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Show me pictures, leave comments, um, tweet me or Insta Instagram me and show me pictures of what your trees look like with the presents underneath and also let me know in the comments below if you prefer to put presents underneath the tree ahead of time or do you wait for christmas eve as well um i love you guys so much my twitter handle is youtube that babe and my instagram is angela that babe so youtube is u-t-u-b-e babe um no oh my gosh i can't even spell youtube that babe U-T-U-B-E-B-A-B-E. -B -E. Yeah. T-H-A. Ugh. Anyway. This is unedited. My brain's not functioning. Figure it out. I'm sure you guys will find me. I'll leave links down in the description box below. I love you guys. And I will see you all on Christmas. Bye.